Breaking news. Welcome to today's headlines. The Federal High Court Practice Directory is a weapon fashioned against Unnamdi Kanu. The Federal High Court Practice Directory is a weapon fashioned against Unnamdi Kanu by Emeka Ugunye. To my dear listeners from wherever you're listening from, please stay tuned as I read to this news. I have studied the new Federal High Court Practice Directory. It is very clear that it is a special weapon designed against Unam De Kanu. If nothing else convinces you of this, the timing of the release of the Practice Directory should be enough to convince you. Indeed, it is now reasonable to conclude that Justice Unyako knew this directory was on the way when she adjourned the ruling on defense application for as long as two months she must she must have done that on purpose to ensure the new practice directory would be out before yesterday's hearing the practice directory soft for justice unyako a number of problems she had been dealing with all along. For instance, it solved issues such as whether a foreign legal advisor like Mr. Bruce Fain and one of the court observers could come into a court to observe the trial or not. Unyako didn't want to be blamed for not letting them in. She cried to her boss. Chief Judge Itoho, we just gave her the directory to absorb the blame. The directory is now above her. Also, you can now understand what a stupid move it was for Barista Ifiai Ejio for to walk out on the court so dramatically because Bruce Fay was not allowed into the court. That move was an unnecessary slight to Justice Unyako and an unacceptable provocation to the court. A smart person should know that every action will attract some reaction. A GO4 is not smart enough to ask himself what might be the consequences of such reckless move. Now it is clear. To Umuchineke, how the court could react to a GeoForce brazen provocative behavior. Now, he won't be able to complain that Bruce Fain was not allowed into the court again. And this takes me to the recent moves made by Bruce Fain. He just made a case against the judge and the Antony General in international court. That was because Bruce Fain understood that the judges were cooking up something to fundamentally undermine Unam Dekanu. As punishment for the stupidity of a G4. Now, Bruce Fain can point to this practice directly as evidence of judicial complicity in the persecution of Unamdi. So you can see how a well-trained American lawyer thinks. Compare that to the blunders by a GO4. The worst thing to happen to you is when your own lawyer puts you in worse trouble than you were when you hired him. Any sensible person can see that Unam De Kanu is in far greater legal mess today than he was six years ago when he hired a GO4. So, overall, a GO4 has not improved the situation for his client. It wasn't it by far. You don't hire a land seller to defend you in a serious criminal trial. It will send you to prison faster. When I recommended that if a GO4 be fired from representing Unamdekanu, Omuchineke 
In their characteristics, arrogance and ignorance did not understand. It would be in the interest of Namde Kano to do so. They allowed a geofo to sufficiently provoke the court. The new practice directory was meant to curtail a geofo's two favorite antics. First, no more walking out on the court. Second, his media propaganda about the case can be checkmated by the court relying on the practice directory. Even yesterday, Justice Inyako was armed and fortified by the new practice directory. She just didn't want to use an, a new powers. Always think before you speak or act because action and reaction are equal and opposite. I have studied, I have studied the new Federal High Court practice directory. It is very clear that it is a special weapon designed against Unam de Kanun. If nothing else convinces you of this, the timing of the release of the practice directory should be enough to convince you. Indeed, it is now reasonable to conclude that Justice Unyako knew this directory was on the way. When she adjourned the ruling on defense application for as long as two months, she must have done that on purpose to ensure the new practice directory would be out before yesterday's hearing. The practice directory solved for Justice Unyako a number of problems she had been dealing with all along. For instance, it solved issues such as whether a foreign legal advisor like Mr. Bruce Fain and what Nese court observers could come into a court to observe the trial or not. Unyako didn't want to be blamed for not letting them in. She cried to her boss, Chief Judge Itoho, who just gave her the directory to absorb the blame. The directory is now our buffer. To my very listeners, from wherever you're listening from, now we've come to the end of our today's news. Please do drop by at the comment section and let us know what your view is all about. Thank you for listening.